voice of our fathers will roam free tomorrow. I repeat, let no woman be seen outside. The consequences of disobeying this order are grave and enormous. Obedience is better than sacrifice. He was ears, let him hear. Rubbish, nonsense. I, imagine. So the form I plan to, to wait tomorrow has just been blown out of the window like that. Hi. Hi. My sister, your problem is weeding up the farm. I don't have food in my house, and my family will go hungry tomorrow. You see? You see what I'm talking about? Your children will go hungry tomorrow. Why should that be? Eh? Why should it be? That is one thing I don't understand. It was the men that started this barbaric tradition of confining women indoors just because a man wearing pieces of raffias wants to dance around the village. If Papa Nkechi knows what is good for him, let him just fill the whole house with food. Or else... Hey! No, no, no. How can you talk like that? You know the issue of masquerade in this community. It's not just wearing raffia and dancing, dancing around the whole village. The Agumpo masquerade carries the sins of the whole village and make propitiation for all of us. Eh, hey, Ejoku, propitiation indeed. Yet, bad things will never cease happening in this village. Abby? Clear your throats. Clear your voices. That's all right. That's all right. Listen now. We are going to attack it. One, two, three, four. Peter's Akama 
and our choir will be croaking like the frogs along the glasses. Will that happen? No. We have to show him that we are the best in this uh, diocese. Yes. Um, I think that's all. Does anybody have anything to say or ask? My bread price is more. Uh, well, they were getting, they were getting, well, in the absence of everyone, that they took no, please. Will you lead us in prayer? Let's go. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. For God, our Heavenly Father, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the heart of thy people, grant that in that same spirit we all may be truly wise and evermore rejoice in your consolation through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I don't know who you like. One of these days you're going to put someone into trouble. Eh, uh, eh, uh, let me put you in the trouble. And if the trouble concerns you, I gladly enter it. You see, that is why you don't ever tell your part well. When others are busy to practice, you're there thinking in pure thoughts. What do you want? Hmm? No thoughts I think about you that are impure. All I think about is how to make you my wife. And to give you plenty children. <laughs> Look at this one. Does one become a husband by singing in a choir, in a village choir? Better go and look for something. Uh, don't worry. I have my plans. Mm -hmm. See, by the grace of God, very soon, I'll become the richest man mm -hmm. in this village. Mm -hmm. Let's wait for that time. Oh, you want? You don't believe in me? It's not that I don't believe. But <laughs> yeah. The Agunko Masquerade will roll abroad tomorrow. No woman is to be seen around. The Agunko Masquerade will roll free tomorrow. Any woman seen outside will have herself to blame. Be wise. Obedience is better than sacrifice. Hey, I will still have fire parties tomorrow. Don't tell me you believe in that nonsense, do you? You can call it whatever you want because you're a man. After all, they didn't say that men should remain in doubt. Ah, Ujuma. Ujuma, seriously. You don't want to tell me you believe that if you come out tomorrow, something will happen to you? But you just heard him now. Listen, the only reason why they said women should not come out tomorrow is because most of the men be running around in their naked bodies. You know, and they will not like women to see them naked. It's all a whole load of rubbish. Are you serious? Or is it one of your many jokes? Ujung, I'm a man. And a son of Akama. I know these things as good as every other villager that runs around in the village. Believe me. What don't I know? Just hope so. Be precise, be precise. If you don't come to choir practice tomorrow, Will I sleep well? Forget that. Hey, I just hope to. Anyway, we'll see tomorrow. What do you mean we'll see tomorrow? Why are you stopping here? Let's go now. No, you're stopping here. I'm going home and you're going home. Oh no. What kind of a wife are you still? Why are you always throwing orders around? Go home, my friend. Would you want? Okay. Promise me to come to choir practice tomorrow. I'll come. But not because of you. I'm coming to sing for my God. Eh, go Bye. Go. You sing for your God, you sing for me. It's the same thing now. Eh, just make sure I come tomorrow. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye. Sleep well. Come <laughs> on! 
Are you not aware that tomorrow is the Agun Kwa Masquerade Festival Day? Uh, and what has that got to do with me? Eh? It's a guinea. Chukuka. Are you not a son of Akamba? You imbesa. Amana. Me imbesa. Don't you think you are the imbecile? You and all these misbegotten children of darkness. Your mates in other communities are busy going to school, working, and helping your community. And all you care is a ritual that will pay you no good. I'm sorry. Open your rotten mouth and call the traditions of our fathers stupid. Hey! Now listen, let me tell you all. The gates of hell are wide open. They are yearning, waiting to receive you all. You shall all be consumed. One by one, by the fire of darkness, you are certain in this village, except you come to repentance. Mark my word. for pagans, unbelievers, those who believe in such things. I don't have any business with Agunko Masu. Come here, Ujuma. A little madness has got into your head. Mama, I'm a Christian and I don't believe in masquerades and their so-called spirit of ancestors. Mm. Ujuma, I'm the one who is a pagan, Ewa. I'm the one who is a pagan. Is it not inside this Bible you are holding that said that we should give to Caesar what is to Caesar and to God his own? Well, Mama, our bishop will be coming in two weeks' time. And we've not finished learning the song we are preparing to sing. The choir master said we should come. And besides, I'm not the only girl who is going to church. Others are going to be there too. After all, the Agunkwa will not come out until later tonight. So before then, I'll be back. Ujuma. Mama. Whatever happens to you is on your head. Mama, nothing will happen. Thank you. 
Arwan, did you not hear the town crier specifically say that no woman, no woman should step outside today? This man goes to church. She is going to church. today because of uh, the mass grade. Okay. So just make sure you turn up tomorrow morning. Eh? Okay, see you tomorrow then. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. But remember, we should start civil 2029 for this uh, arrow that's coming yes. up. The Christmas okay. arrow. to you. What's this? What? Would you? Would you? What happened? What, what did he say? The masqueraders. Oh, masqueraders? Oh, masqueraders? The mother of Jesus. They did this to you? One after the other. They, oh. they beat you? Collect all the files. Take it back to the church, okay? okay. And come and meet us up. Okay. Sir, we're going to fight this. Amanda cannot go scot free after doing this to us. Boys, let's go! Yes. There is we and the match Sir, They're not stopping us. Where are you going? Hey, you are not going to fight them, are you? <coughs> Shonto, Shonto, call your friends back. The good Lord did not say that we should pay back violence with violence. We should report this matter first to the Reverend Father. And have him do what? Advise us to sit calm and turn your attic. No way. This is just too much. Whatever Chukuka has decided, that we will do. Oh, so please go back. Uh, Ujum, don't worry. I'll take you to the wife of the catechist so that they can take care of you. Father, there is trouble brewing up everywhere. Uh, why are you so agitated? What happened? Father, I told members of my choir to come to practice today. You know, we needed more practice because of the bishop's visit. Uh -huh. And so what has that got to do with the problem you said is brewing up? I did not know that the village had announced that they were bringing out the Agunko masquerade today. Women are not supposed to be out when the masquerade is about. One of the female choristers was coming for practice and she was beaten up by the masquerades. What? Father, they even raped her. God. She ran into the church this morning, bleeding with blood bruises all over her body. She was, the side was pitiable, Father. Some of the boys have gone after the masquerade. Father, there's going to be bloodshed, I'm afraid. Please, let us go after them and stop them. So, what do we do now? Uh, but where's the young woman? In the church. I think we have to go and see her now first, so that she doesn't do anything to harm herself, okay? Yes, sir. Let's go, let's go. Uh, John! Father! John! Father! Uh, take care of the house. I'll be back soon. Let's go. 
And I know the Agu Kwama's curate does not come out until night. Except that you want to achieve your evil purpose. If not, I've never heard that Agu Kwa raped a woman. Chukwuka, never has it been heard. Never has it been heard that a woman walked the streets on the day the spirits roamed the earth. Oh, no, no. Chukwuka, and if you insist, if you insist to fight this, your death is what you seek. All right, I shall stop this madness now. All of you, will fight now. Okay. <laughs> Our traditional and culture. 
and join the church? Impossible! Impossible! Bobo! Bobo! Ayaya! Bobo! Well, Mabu! Bobo! Bobo! Ayaya! Bobo! 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 to apologize for what has just happened. As for the automobile, the whole community will replace that. That's a promise. But what I don't know what to do about is the indignity suffered by your person. That's all right, Your Highness. I was only coming to find out what happened. And if necessary, I apologize. The boys from the mission that attacked the masquerade were not sent by anybody. They did that on their own accord. Of course, I know that uh, the church couldn't have uh, sent them. After all, we have been coexisting over years. Oh, yes. oh, yes. oh. But what they did is a grievous insult, an injury that no apology can save. They committed an abomination capable of setting the anger of the gods on us. If propitiation is not made. Your Highness, even the boys went ahead to tell me that one of my choir girls was, was defiled. Hmm? Your Highness, she was raped. I have an ugly! What? That a masked raped a girl? What did you just say? That was why the boys attacked the masquerade in the first place. Hey! Gods of my forefathers, this is an abomination of the worst kind, whatever!
ujung mah ujung mah hei mata rabutan eh bubu bebu ujung mah wajah pun seriu wajah pun seriu ujung mah wajah pun sebaik aku gak aku kuo mas kue aku wajah aku wajah ujung mau kuih bawa nanya apa bagi nanya ujung mera pecam ujung mera pecam it's alright you wouldn't leave it's alright it's alright I don't think this is the right time to scold her. She needs to rest. The Reverend Father said I should bring her home. And the parish will take care of her. We shall be coming from time to time to visit with her. Please. Please, madam, take her in. Madam, take care of her. Take it by force. If you keep quiet and shut our eyes for the fear of mere pieces of wood, then evil will continue to grow in our village. Shut your mouth, you 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 mistake of the gods. Because you now carry this thing you call this piece of paper you call Bible. You think you could, you, you are not a god? Eh? Do you know the consequences of what you have done? Mama. Don't be afraid of the consequences of what I have done. After I'm the one that did it, let me carry these consequences on my head. Leave me and those masqueraders alone. Just leave me and them. Just leave me with them. Osuji, oh, where from? From Mama Chukweka's house. The boy that uh, unmasked the Agunko masquerade. Oh, my brother. It's true. The kind of things children of nowadays do. Baffle me. Can you imagine, um, what is his name? Amanna. Amanna. Leading a group of boys with the Agunko masquerade. To beat up an innocent girl who was going to the church. To the extent of defiling her. That's good for her. That's good for her. These Christians are always looking for a way to oppose our tradition. Oh, Suji. Do they now claim that they did not hear the tank crier's warning? Oh, Suji. An elder should not talk like that. Uh -huh. Yes, an elder should not talk like that. Let me ask you. Who sent Amanna to go and fight for the gods? I don't know. Oh. And I'm sure the father didn't ask uh, Chukwuka to help him defend his church. What happened was as a result of overzealousness on both sides. And I have always said it, that both the Christians and the believers of uh, traditional religion both profess God. The only difference is in the modes of worship. And so, 
we should not kill ourselves over that. Oh, is that what you say? Yes. Let the eagle perch and let the pigeon perch. The sky is enough to accommodate all kinds of birds from the wild to the domestic. You made a point there. You made a point there. <laughs> you made a point. Thank you very Thank much. You very much. Thank hey, you. Let me you guys see my children. Okay, let's keep our fingers crossed. Okay. Thank you. Till the matter comes up. Okay. So I came to see how you're doing. Would you? I just want to tell you that I'm. I'm sorry for what happened to you. You know, I was the one that convinced you that nothing will happen to you. Hey, sorry. Sorry. It's okay. I heard you went and fought with the masqueraders and unmasked the Agonko. Yes. What am I so. What, what do you expect me to do? I couldn't just let them go scot free after what they've done to you. Defying a child of God. They say it's an abomination. And besides, you could have killed somebody. Or what if they had killed you? Would you? Who decides what's abomination? The pagan somewhere who doesn't know what he's worshipping? Or a, a disease reading mistake of a village boy? Tell me who? I just hope you know what you're up against, Chukuka. Because the way people talk about what you've done scares me. And besides, the people you disgraced are not going to keep quiet and watch you roam free. Just be careful. It's alright, Chuma. I'll be alright. I fought for the Lord. I am a soldier of the cross. Nothing will happen to me, okay? I'm concerned. I don't see anything wrong in what Chukuka has done. Ah, it is high time someone taught this man a lesson. Mm -hmm. This their so-called culture and tradition is only meant to intimidate women. Yeah. So Chukuka was now commissioned to go and fight for them, eh? Um, ma, ma, Aboma. So tell me, who sent Chukuka to go and venture into the domain of the gods? If it his father's before he dare not. There is nothing you can do, my sister. There is nothing. It is only the way of the youth. Even though I can understand how you feel. You cannot understand how I feel, Aboma. You can't. Chukuka is not your son. You are not the topic of every discussion in this community. How can you tell me you understand how I feel? Eh? People don't embrace, embrace you only to turn around and mock you immediately your back is turned. Calling you the, the mother of an abominable son. So you don't understand how I feel. Father, this has come at no small cost from the community. We have done this to show that we are peace-loving people. Oh, yes. And we do not mean any harm to the church. <laughs> Igwe, I'm so much overwhelmed, Igwe. I'm so much overwhelmed, elders. Thank you. Brother. Although you mentioned it, but I didn't expect it so soon and this big. May God bless you, Igwe. May God bless you, elders. Thank you. Thank you very much, Father. 
But there is one more thing you have to do for us, however. Our land still stands desecrated by the abomination committed by our people. And we must have to do something about it as a matter of urgency. If we do not want catastrophe of unparalleled proportion to befall this community. Therefore, we appeal to you to inform those boys from your mission to come forward and pay the rights of uh, appeasement and atonement like others have performed. Those who rape their girl. perhaps I understand you, but Christianity is not like that. You don't know what you ask of a good Christian. No good Christian will agree to subject himself to the pagan rituals. <laughs> Father Damien, we all are Christians. I go to church and you know that I am a very good Christian. But a time comes in one's life when it becomes very, very, very important that we forget some of the teachings of Christianity and do what we must do for our forefathers and our gods. Your Highness, Christianity is not a garment. Uh, well, um, that's all right. Our role is to give a piece of advice. But let me still warn that if that cleansing ritual is not performed by those young men, they stand the risk of running mad or dying mysteriously. All powers belong to the Almighty God. And anyone that takes refuge under his umbrella shall not suffer. Uh, well, Nietzsche, our duty is to uh, inform them so that they take their decisions that we have done. Um, Father, <laughs> do enjoy your automobile. Thank you very much, Ibe. Thank you very much, Adas. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. You're welcome. While we have been disgraced. Oh. What do you expect? When we allow old men who are already close to their grave to run the affairs of the community. Just because they say that grey has the sign of wisdom. Oh, I hate all this thing. Yalla. Listen and listen to me, Amanda. Even if we run from here to Oyofo, we can never achieve anything. I mean, things can never change. Yes. I say yes. We have to decide what course of action to take. There is nothing to decide. There is nothing to decide. I, Amanna, swear by the 1,001 deities in the land that Chukuka and his fellow churchgoers will see fire. Yes. yes. Fire. Yes. How? Yes. How? You do not cross the stream till you get to it. A form. A form. The calabash of open sala should not be sniffed because it must be opened. Yes. Huh? I'm going to I am I am I I 
enjoin you all as good Christians to be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. The righteousness in life that God says. Therefore, brothers and sisters, get rid of all moral fields and the evils that are so prevalent. I
Almighty, he will not allow this just to go by. That is the point I'm making, Katkist. Just look at my body, Katkist. The church must not let this to lie low in the name of Christianity. Imagine a masquerade in the church. The father was flogged, Katkist. This is the worst sacrilege ever known to man. So, what do you want the church to do? Go into war with hiddens? Take the community and their masquerade to the court of law and seek redress. They must be made to pay adequate compensation to the church for what they have done. Then, where is the Christ in us? What then makes the difference between the church and the unbelievers? We will fight a battle, not that line of battle. We will fight on our knees, praying God to vindicate himself. God kissed. Eh? God kissed. I still think that these people knowingly take the church for granted because they know we will not fight back. Let us teach them a lesson for once. No. No, choir master. The battle is the Lord's. Eh? Go home and take care of yourself. Go home. There's a masquerade in the church. Oh, yeah. oh what an abomination. Oh, what abomination. There's a Christian of the house of God. Oh, Oh, what a sacrilege. Come on and sing again. There's a masquerade in the church. Oh, what an abomination. There's a Christian of the house of God. Oh, what a sacrilege. Today in this world, men have lost their senses. They have no reverence for God. Of war. All they think about is tradition. My Bible tells me that you are a raging fire. But you see what they've done to your place of worship. Father, do not stay silent and watch this pass, Father. Rise up and take vengeance of this. My Lord. You said that vengeance is yours. I need not fight. Because I know you've done the fighting. The control of all this, Jesus Christ. Rescue me. Amanna. Amanna. Oh? Again. I'm beginning to get scared. You see, you really made a mistake. Flogging a few people. Yes. But urinating on the sacrament. Ha! It is a big mistake, oh. A former. Our former Amanna. When they beat you up, disgraced our um, uh, uh, masquerade. Was that a mistake? Huh? I say, was that a mistake? They defiled the very thing that we hold sacred. They spat in the face of our gods. We did the same to them. If he is as strong as they claim, let him fight for himself. Let him get up and fight. Oh, oh, 
Morgan! Dad, get on This is just the beginning. And anybody who spits in the face of our gods will be dealt with. And any one of you who is not with me, Ngwa. Ngwa. I'm going to go Again. If you are with me, then I want you to know that this is just the beginning. The battle has just begun. Opoma. 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 Come on, sit down. Sit down. We have done enough to these people. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> eh? mm. We bought the Sadaska. They bought him another one. We destroyed it. As if that was not enough. We went to the church. You urinated on their sacrament. Guinea Wemezian. Guinea Wemezian. You flogged the Sada. Mbano. It is enough. It is enough. Abom. Obama, eh? are you suggesting that I should keep quiet while some group of infidels desecrate the very culture and tradition of our forefathers all in the name of worshipping what I don't know? But Amanna, not to the extent of going to burn their houses. Yeah. Come to think of it, do you know that Chukuka and Somto might not have the support of their parents. Do you know that? Amanna, I think they are right. We've done enough harm. I think you people have a point. A very good point. We have done enough. Stupid idiots, fools! I can now see that your livers have failed you. You are too afraid to defend the very culture that your forefathers fought so hard to preserve. Of all, you and your group of lazy egos are too afraid to fight for your rights. Then I, Amanai Gurube, will do it all alone. Unananu? I'll break this on your head. Amanna, we still insist it is okay. Or oh, are you uh, uh, the Agumkochi priest? Uh, or the Igwe son? Uh, 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 you can all go to hell. Go to hell! Amanna, run away from me, I'm going with you. Amanna, wait for me also. Of this act and hang them, we 
that rebuild her house or bring back her crops? Igwe, I have lost everything I have in this land because of Amana and his overzealous cohorts who think that my son should not have defended the girl they, they defiled. Igwe, the world is changing and we are closed up in this community and all these things are happening. Igwe, those who destroyed my farmland and the house of this lady must be brought to justice. Otherwise, we are going to do exactly what they did and perhaps more. And I'm sure, Igwe, you will not be happy if we start going around burning each other's house. Honestly, I am confused. <sighs> oh, no. Igwe. I want you to go to the police station and report everything that has happened. And make sure that all those boys are apprehended and brought to book. Igwe. With due respect, Father. If the church is satisfied with keeping quiet with what's happened, I am not. Never. Right now, I don't have a home. Oh. We have lost enough, Father. We must do something, Father. And I think it's about time we drop this uh, meek as a dove attitude and face facts. Yes. Yes. Sure. Yes. This is getting too much. If you have done what we should have done a long time ago, all oh, this will not have happened. No, no. never. Chukuka. And you think the solution is to become that which they are? Bam! Mm -hmm. Let me say my own now. Let me just say my own. I personally will do everything in my power to avenge what those boys did to my father and I. Imagine! My whole father's farm destroyed just like that. Oh! That's why we are here, father. We have to do something. We are ready to fight. What has been done cannot be undone. Since this thing started, I've lost more than material things. A loss I will carry for the rest of my life. Please, let us leave what has happened to be. I don't want what happened to me to happen to somebody else. Please. Did you hear her? Did you all hear what she said? Yes, Father. My children, go home. My God will fight his battle. So go home, my children. Thank you, Father. So who do you think will believe that rubbish talk? Who doesn't know Chukuka in this village? Chukuka, who used to dance in the Agon for masquerade? He's an initiator. Come, I know, but now he has repented. You don't expect him to fold his hands watching the Akunko masqueraders fighting the children of God. And I say you are talking rubbish. Sit down there and be deceiving yourself. As far as I am concerned, Chukuka was merely fighting for Junwa, his lover. Ah, ah, that is most of godly thing to say. Oh. oh, so you think we don't know? That both Chukwoka and Ujungwa have a lot of things in common. My dear sister, wake up from your sleep. There is nobody in this village who doesn't know. Children of God indeed.
my soul. I didn't know you were still around. Yes, I have been. I hope you're not so angry. Over what? That I stopped you from going to attack Amanda and his group. No, it's all right. I'm not angry. I just didn't want you to get hurt. Uju, I'm sorry. Uju, I'm very sorry. You see, I just couldn't stand what, what they did to you. You know? And I hope we don't allow this to change the way we feel about each other. But if you feel so deeply about me, don't do anything else. Let it all go, because the Bible says that we should forgive one another. Hmm? Do you know the second stanza to that song? Second verse, you don't know it? Okay, let me teach you. Oh, what a wonderful, wonderful day. Day I will never forget After I wander in darkness away Jesus my Savior I met Oh what a tender compassionate friend He met the needs of my heart, in shadow despair with joy, I am sin, and made out of darkness depart. Heavens came down, and glory filled my soul. <laughs> Amanna. Amanna. Oh, father. Leave the seat for now. Amanna, as you can see, you are gradually wasting away. If you continue like this, you will drop very soon. What else can I do? After I saw those two things I told you, I don't understand anymore. I've been everywhere for a cure. But nobody seems to know what the problem is. I told you. I told you on the day you flogged the Reverend Father. Not to lay hands on him. You not only did, but also urinated on the sacrament. Ah! The Tell me that that is the cause of my problem. Don't you ever! <coughs> you can threaten me all you want. But I have to say, we have to do something. I insist we see the Reverend Father. For him to pray for you. You can't continue like this. Look at, just look at. You are alive, decaying! I should go and beg their priests. I 
Hey, Mbani. Mbani. Maybe that will be the best thing. Our Igwe. Our Igwe. Arrested and locked me up. For fighting for my culture and tradition. suffered enough. I am not going to beg anybody. Mbani. As you wish, Amanma. But I still insist we see the Reverend Father. We have to see the Reverend Father. Yes, I can hear you. Mm. Young man, the nail that resists the crushing slam of the hammer will either bend or break. Yes, yes. Mm. No man, no matter how strong, can fight for the gods. Yes, I can hear you. <clears throat> be careful! Be careful or else you'll be ground to pieces under the weight of the burden you have chosen to carry. Wise one, I don't understand. You have pitched yourself against the ultimate power, the deciding force of night and day. Wise one, what sacrifices should I make? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. No sacrifice. And you have to run fast and do that which you know you must do. Or else the earth will open and swallow that which it once gave life. I brought my brother here for some time now. He has been sick, and I've taken him everywhere. I mean, everywhere, but nobody seems to know what is wrong with him. Please help us, please, please. Young man, what did you do? Um, nothing. Nothing. strongly in my spirit that this man here is suffering from the vexation of the Lord. And unless he purges himself of, of whatever sin he has committed, unless he confesses and repents of it, he stands the risk of losing his life. My God. Take him away. Oh, Pastor, please, please. Let him go and confess of his please. sins and repent of them. Otherwise, otherwise. Let's go. This is serious. He, he 
sure looks like sea. Abomination. 
into the house of God to, to desecrate the holy things of God. Jehovah's anger has come, his judgment has come upon the mother. There's a masquerade in the church. Sing it, daughter. Oh, what an abomination. Oh, desecration of the house of God. 